Hello guys, how are you doing? So, welcome back to my reactions and as you can see I'm going to watch episode 11 of the second season of Code Geass today. So in this last episode we saw a lot of action and things are really not looking good for the side of Lelouch and we see that um, the Britannians are working together with the, the Chinese Federation in order to, to take down these, um, these Black Knights and also for the Chinese Federation to get the Empress back. And yeah, they even add white in this specific place and it's um, apparently a really important one so uh, the Chinese Federation will think twice uh, before deciding on attacking them. Uh, so yeah, right now they have some time to think about things, but um, at the same time we saw like a, a really weird situation by the end, or at least it was really weird for me, uh, because Lelouch was saying that uh, he was going to, pu to put um, a plan in, um, in motion, and uh, suddenly we see uh, Lelouch at school with the other girls. So I'm not too sure of what happened, it seemed to be at the exact same time, but yeah, it, it really confused me since we see that Lelouch is currently in battle with uh, the Chinese Federation. Uh, so yeah, it really makes me wonder about uh, who exactly uh, like is this guy at school. I don't know which one is the real one uh, right now and I'm hoping that this episode makes it more clear. And uh, yeah, either way, on top of all of this, Cullen also got kidnapped, so that was really bad. And really hope that nothing bad happens to her and, and that she gets uh, freed as soon as possible. But yeah, either way, I really can't wait to start this next episode to discover what exactly happened. So I really hope you guys are ready and let's start it. Hmm. Yeah, about this. I wonder who's like the real one or... Oh. Yeah, that's good at least. Also was wondering about uh, if it was Rollo somehow, but he's here, so couldn't be him. Hmm. He stand in. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. Everyone is there. Well... Apparently it's happening. Damn, they don't even care about that. Damn, that's really sad. I really hope they can protect this Empress because she's in the middle of all of this mess. And it's not even because of her. I really like her. Yeah, the situation is getting more and more complicated with each episode. At least they instantly revealed what exactly happened. Like with L Lelouch being in two sides or two places at the same time. Just actually someone disguised as him. And that was good for him because people there won't believe that it's Lelouch as zero. Still hiding that. And this orange guy is getting some new things from VV, so that can't be good. But I really love every single episode of this anime. 
it's so easy to get like invested on it and just want to watch the next one. Let's see what exactly happens in this one. Yeah. They don't care about one more. And these guys. These guys really need to go fast. Hmm. Gollum. Suzaku is there, so... He better not let anything bad happen to her. Hmm. I will never understand why they send choppers to these situations. Damn. This is a big mess right now. And Toto is not in a good condition. Hmm. I didn't really care. Unfortunately. I really hope they take this on this guy's on. Of course. Damn, these comparisons. I really hate these guys. Oh, damn. Yeah, that's really dangerous. Oh, we see her. Hmm. Yeah, it is. And this guy. Damn. This is a death flag to Toto.
Yeah. Oh, nice. Really? I really hate these IU nukes or something. Let's see what happens now. Hmm. Doesn't agree with this situation. That enough of it. Yeah, that one is really strong. Oh, damn. Well, good luck with that then. Just like that. Slight. Hmm. Yeah, that would actually be really good. If they defeated these IU nukes and somehow the Empress and Toto ruled over the Chinese Federation and made it a better country, that would be good. Hmm. Yep. Oh, damn. Okay, that was really nice. That really backfired on them. Yep. That was really good. Damn, turning the tides. Oh. Wait, what's happening? Some visions. Hmm. Exactly. I wonder about those scenes. I need to rewatch that, but... The first idea I got was... Hmm...
first idea I got was that um, that girl killed, or not killed, but was involved in uh, what happened to Lelouch before in the past. Damn. A that weapon. These guys were really not good. Ooh. Now they have both Cullen and Nunali. And I mean, Nunali was always like from Britannia, I guess, since she's the Viceroy. But still. Oh. Yeah, exactly. So they're trying to make another CC. This is really nice. Tears of happiness. I really like these two. Especially together. Oh. Yeah. That's also true. Let's see what happens. Hmm. I mean, it's a... I understand them. It'd be nice if they actually loved each other. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Love is power. <laughs> oh. Um. Okay. That's a lot of information. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. <laughs> that was mean. Ooh. 
This is good. Well, yeah, about that. So buy some time. Oh. What exactly happened? Did she like kiss her or something like that? That would be... Quite something. This is it. Hmm. The leader will replace me. This angle. So they're after this place now. Hmm. Oh. That's how they're going to do it. The swapping. Oh. This is bad though. Because he doesn't know. Oh. There she is. I, I really wonder about this one. They're actually going to stay there now. That's not that good for Lelouch. Hmm. Oh, and it's over. Yeah, I'm really wondering about this girl that um, uses the, like, the Mordred or something. The Nightmare. Um, but yeah, we saw that uh, she clashed with the CC. And there was, like, these flashbacks. And CC realized that, um, like, she did something. Like, this other girl did something. And I'm not sure of what it was. The flashbacks were really fast. I need to watch them again. But the first idea I got... We saw a bit of Lelouch, I believe. When he was young. So I don't know... If she was the one who was like ordered... To kill um, his mother. Or if she was like... Um, involved in that incident. But yeah, it's something that I'm definitely going to check. That specific scene with her. But this was overall a really good episode. At least things ended in kind of a nice way. At least um, the Eunuchs, um, they, they are gone finally because they were just being... Like this um, 
his mentality was just really wrong and uh, just really glad that they are gone for now. And uh, not for now, I mean, they died, so yeah. But I really wanted to see like them gone and then uh, maybe the Empress together with Toto. Uh, I'm not too sure if it's going to be with Toto or not because uh, they just decided that uh, they're going to allow the Empress to make her own choice. Uh, but yeah, it would be good. Uh, if the Chinese Federation allied with um, like the, the the Japanese and uh, with this black like with the Black Knights, of course they're Japanese. So yeah, it's uh, it's going to be interesting to see what she decides. And right now I'm just uh, really curious uh, about uh, this uh, specific situation that ended uh, uh, almost at the end as well when um, uh, this one these guys as Lelouch uh, found uh, Shirley and she was trying to prevent Shirley from watching what was happening behind her because of the secret uh, door and stuff. And I'm not exactly sure, but I believe that uh, she actually kissed uh, Shirley. And uh, if that happened, Lelouch is not going to know it. And that explains why she's so affected. It's something that she was really not expecting, uh, expecting most likely. And I believe she still knows something about Zero. Uh, like uh, she lost uh, her memories about Zero because um, uh, Lelouch did that before in the in the season one. But um, we know that she ended up reading this uh, note that she had in her diary or something. Like one of the notes she discarded and threw away. Uh, she ended up finding it and. Um, uh, discovered some things uh, again because she already knew th uh, them before but now she knows uh, them again and I don't know what she what this is going to imply and it's probably something that we will see in the next episode uh, but yeah right now just uh, really happy with uh, how everything ended and that they managed to keep the the emperor safe and um, at least win this small battle and it was like not really a small battle, but it was uh, really it it was really not looking good uh, for the, these Black Knights as uh, it, they had to fight against both the Chinese Federation and the Britannians. But uh, in the end, we saw that um, uh, Todo was uh, not really agreeing with uh, what was happening and how these uh, I eunuchs were willing to just um, discard the Empress and uh, she, saying that she could be replaced. And it was really, really clever of uh, uh, Lelouch. I don't know how exactly they did that, but uh, they managed to record uh, this uh, specific moment with them saying that um, they were uh, uh, like about to discard uh, this, imp this uh, empress and um, like basically kill her. And now everyone in this Chinese Federation knows about this. So they were being hated um, by all of these people and they ended up being killed, so that's the end for them. And right now I just really hope that uh, this Empress um, manages to, to, to help the country and make this Chinese fed, uh, Federation a better place. And I'm still not sure if she's actually going to pick someone to marry her, but we'll see about that in the future. Uh, but yeah, anyway, right now I'm still also uh, thinking about Cullen, because she she's still in the possession of uh, the Britannians. I mean, she got kidnapped, so that was really bad for her. And I really hope that um, something good happens and that uh, she eventually gets freed. I'm not too sure how uh, that would happen. But yeah, it's definitely something to take into consideration. We still have a lot of things uh, to think about in these next episodes. And right now I'm just trying to follow as best as possible. Uh, but yeah, I'm really, uh, again, going to look back in these... Uh, uh, previous moments, uh, specifically that one with the flashbacks that Sissy got when she hit uh, uh, Mordred or like um, uh, the, the girl uh, riding it. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be interesting to see what exactly uh, that meant. So with this, I really hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this episode. And if you did, please like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, I'll see you all in the next one. So take care, guys.